Well, after pushing back the opening numerous times, the Bismarck Harvest Medical Marijuana Dispensary is finally opening. New this morning, Aaron Fields talked with the general manager to see what the opening will do for the community. Aaron, good morning. Good morning, Becky. They turned off the lights behind me, so I don't know if you can see it that well, but this dispensary is located across the street from the Bank of North Dakota, right on Memorial Highway, and this will be the second dispensary to open in the western part of North Dakota. And I talked to the general manager who tells me this opening is going to be bringing in a variety of benefits to the community. I think the, the most immediate and first benefit that we're bringing is the, um, the quality of education that we have. Um, so that we can educate and empower our patients to take a, an active role in uh, improving their quality of life. Hecht hopes that the new dispensary will go further than just helping patients feel better, but really bring the community together. Letting people know we're here, why we're here, what we're doing. Look forward to partnering with potentially other businesses, nonprofits, um, volunteering, you know, anything and everything we can do to lift the community up is what we want to do. Anyone is welcome in the Harvest of Bismarck waiting room, but in order to get into the sales room, you are required to have a medical marijuana license. Hecht assures me that they also take security very seriously at the new building. I can let you know that it's an extremely secure and safe facility. Regarding the, the protecting the identity and the privacy of our patients, that is of utmost importance to us. So uh, that is part of our training and education for my team is ensuring that we operate in a way that is respectful, professional, and discreet uh, so that everybody feels comfortable here. All the products sold are grown, packaged, mm -hmm. produced, and delivered within the state of North Dakota. They hope that this centralized location will help reach more people, but hopes the public will visit the store for other reasons as well. You know, if we're doing our jobs correctly, people will want to come see us, even if they live a little further away. And what is Hecht most excited about for the big opening, you may wonder? To see my team interact with patients. I've already had the good fortune of interacting with patients in need, and it is the most, if not one of the most rewarding experiences of my life, is being able to help people um, feel better and live a better quality of life. So for me to be able to see my team do that, um, I'm really excited about that. For KX News, I'm Aaron Fields. The official opening will be happening at 10 a.m. this morning and dispensaries in Minot, Dickinson, Devil's Lake and Jim Jamestown are still being planned, Becky. And um, if you want to have any more information about how you can get your hands on a medical marijuana license, you can head to our KX page. Well, I'll be posting that link soon. But Becky, I know you did get to cover um, the Williston opening too, and aren't they just really nice? They're kind of like bougie and very nice. I felt, <laughs> felt good in there. Yeah, that's a good word for it. And I think what's really nice about them is that they really spend the time to train their employees so that they know about the product they're selling. It's, it's medicine at the end of the day. Aaron, thank you.